what do you think your greatest challenge was um, from high school to college, from college to the NBA? And what advice do you have for guys that are that are trying to make that that jump? Man, I think my my greatest challenge was. Um, one, getting acclimated to being outside of East Houston, right? I think when you're from Houston, I went to University of Colorado my first year, first two years in college. You, you One, you make the adjustment being away from, from home, you know, living on your own. The, the main adjustment that I had to make from, from, from college to the NBA was being 22 years old with $600,000 in the bank, you know, Lexus GS 300 because I was a, I was a big Jay Z fan and I, <laughs> I bought my first car was because Jay Z had just come out with Reasonable Doubt and having access to Club Phoenix Club Echelon with a little money in your pocket and all the trappings that come from being young with money and having to you know and then really going from being a person that your parents send you money to a person that's now providing for your family. Right. And man, and, and it's just, that that's a hell of an adjustment. Like I, I look at what's going on with John ja Morant right now. You know, and, and people criticize the kid, but you got a quarter of a billion dollar contract. And he's still a kid. And you're still a kid. And now you essentially become your parents' parent, right? They come to him for money now. You know, and, 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 and man, that's a hell of a thing. And you still, uh, you know, and they, they, they knocking for having a pistol. I'm like, hey, man, you, you got a quarter billion dollars. You should have a pistol. <laughs> you, you, you should have security and a pistol. Real. You know what I'm saying? And I, I just, man, I, I, you know, I'm by the grace of God, man, I made it through. I seen cats get robbed in Houston. I seen cats get shot. I seen basketball players get robbed. Uh, I made it through, you know, knock wood, man, without any of that stuff happening to me. I had some good friends around me, and one, one, one of the best things I think I could have ever done is I didn't really surround myself with a bunch of yes men. You know what I'm saying? If, if I was doing something that wasn't cool, I had the kind of partners that'd be like, yeah, that, that, that ain't cool, don't do that. You know, we ain't going that route. You know, we made some mistakes, but fortunately it was stuff that we could get out of. You know what I'm saying? Right. And, and, and thank God there wasn't no cell phone cameras back then. <laughs> Woo! For all your latest hey, news, hey, all hey, you hey. gotta do is tap hey, in. Hey. This for all hey. my bosses, they hey. got it in off the back end. Woo. Lights, camera, turn them lights off. I'm about action. For all your sports news and entertainment, this relentless. Bitch on game. game.